After standard mechanically aligned distal femoral and proximal tibial cuts have been made, the extension gap is assessed. The limb is placed in extension and the adjustable spacer block is inserted into the knee, and using the lamina spreader, the block is tensioned. Once the collateral ligaments are tensioned and the extension gap is determined to be symmetric, the measurement of the estimated poly thickness, as read on the adjustable spacer block, is noted. Alternatively, the fixed spacer blocks from the iBalance TKA instrument set can be used to assess the extension space. The angel wing may be used to estimate the ML size of the femoral component relative to the resected distal femur. Once the extension space has been assessed, the knee is brought into 90 degrees of flexion and attention is turned to the flexion space. The short collared IM rod is connected to the T handle and inserted into the IM canal of the femur until the collar is flush with the hole. The tensioner body with a spacer matching the measurement of the estimated poly thickness attached, 8 mm in this example, is assembled onto the exposed IM rod and seated flush against the resected distal femur. The femoral sizing stylus is inserted into the posterior cutting slot on the tensioner body and the tip of the stylus placed on the deep sulcus of the trochlea. The laminar spreader is inserted into the space directly posterior to the IM rod and the collateral ligaments are tensioned to a similar tension as the extension space. Note the femoral sizing readout on the stylus. The angel wing is then used to assess the anterior femoral resection depth and ensure the femur will not be notched. Once the femoral component size is determined to be correct, the pinholes for the 4-in-1 block are prepared with the drill pin. Alternatively, the tensioner body can be pinned in place with two drill pins and the posterior femoral resection completed through the cutting slots on the tensioner body. The tensioner body and IM rod are removed from the femur. The 4-in-1 block matching the size measured on the femoral sizer is placed under the distal femur and the femoral preparation is completed in the standard fashion.